So uh, it sounds very nice. The problem is that the keys make far too much noise. Yeah. So if we turn the uh, if you turn the volume down or turn it off, down. that's that one there. Right. So yeah. we'll have. So you get a continual keyboard noise at any time. So the key bits we have here, we have the two spare parts from Yamaha, the upper felt and the lower felt. So to take it apart, we're removing three screws. Okay, so with the three back screws undone, we should be able to slide this gently forward and then it comes straight off. So we're now looking inside the piano and what we're going to do is remove the sliding keyboard cover. Ooh. Done, so that unlocks a hole in the channel. Right. Right, so those two screws, we can slide this back. And you've gone too far. Oh, up, there we go. And then down at your end. There and you go. Out. And that's the keyboard cover removed. <coughs> Have to take out the ten screws then, holding these five brackets. Right, so that's the ten screws holding the brackets and there's one at the end here there we are, that's it okay nice done. taking out the two screws in there and here which hold the end pieces so that's the next job and then the end blocks lift off sliding this way first yep One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then the two smaller ones in here and at this end as well. So we're going to take all those out. Reasonable job. Right. Four. Okay, we're sliding the keyboard unit backwards now. Mm -hmm. Okay. There we go. Very gently lifting up the keyboard to expose the connection underneath for the cables. You can then pull the plug out and free the keyboard entirely. So this is the keyboard assembly now removed from the rest of the piano, then being now to strip out the felts and replace them. We're removing the bottom felt, which is just a sticky pad on the plastic and the crossbars. Ah yes, there you are. And lay that carefully in place. And that's the bottom front stunt. So this is the keyboard now now back in up the right way and you can see the new felt in position with the hammers resting on it when the keys are not being pressed and already you can hear that's now completely silent when the key goes back so that's a big improvement right so the next job then is to take off the upper felt it's this one here it may take a bit of encouragement oh well done is that is it all coming off let's stop for a minute no, we need that's to, pulling the plastic, so breaking to, the uh, top layer of plastic. So we just need to ease that off with a knife. Evenly across the keys. Half an hour later, we're still Is it half cleaning the keys, yes. At the end of the job, the plastic should be completely clean. with 
base bit by bit. Okay. All right, let's turn her over. Gently bring the keyboard over. Just need to go back on. Brackets back so that keep the yep. track secure. I think it's what I'm is the, the bit underneath, you see. Oh, I see. Mm -hmm. Et voilà. Thank you. 